Three days after he went missing, the body of 25-year-old Jeff Woodruff was pulled from the water in Saugatuck today. Police and family were actively searching for him when dive teams recovered the body. 24-Hour News 8's Mark Thompson was on the scene this afternoon and spoke with family and friends. He joins us live tonight in studio. Mark. So just a sad turn of events, and we were on our way this afternoon to interview the family about their ongoing search efforts when we got word that police discovered a body. The body of 25-year-old Jeff Woodruff was pulled from the Kalamazoo River in Saugatuck just before 3.30 this afternoon. Friends and family were on scene when word came down that Woodruff was gone. He was the most loving, down-to-earth person. Reported to police yesterday, Woodruff was last seen around 11.30 Saturday night here at Wally's Bar. People who saw and heard from him that night say he had been drinking and may have been intoxicated. Two clues led police to the search area. They got a call that night reporting a young man sprawled out in the grass in this park. It's on the water's edge about a block from the bar. And then a key piece of evidence was found in that same area. His cell phone was found in the park Sunday morning is the reason that we started the search there with the dive team. Friends and family spent the day posting flyers around town hoping for the best. Through her tears, Woodruff's mother thanked everyone who helped search for her son. And all the prayers that were said, you know. Woodruff had just moved to the area about a year ago and had been working at this antique shop off Blue Star Highway. And those who knew him well say he was as loyal as they come. He would do anything for anybody at the drop of a hat. Loved his family more than anybody you know. Most caring person ever. Police are conducting a full investigation. They have no reason to suspect foul play, but they will wait for autopsy results before drawing any conclusions. Bro.